Well, we were all off enjoying our Thursdays or, you know, getting ready to go to Fridays. You know, also, you know, caveat, I was traveling to uh, Cancun for my best friend's wedding. And, uh, yes, I'm doing this from my hotel room. Uh, so I apologize for the lack of light here. I'll try to make it better. Uh, it doesn't really do it. Anyway, point is, uh, yes, we were all just enjoying our day, getting ready for the weekend, doing whatever we got to do. If you're me, uh, going to uh, enjoy the breakfast here and have a good time and also bring you the latest Vikings content, which – Kind of leads us to uh, this point. So the Vikings fired defensive coordinator Ed Donatel after one season, and we can't say it was a shock. I mean, this guy was. Uh, and I'm not going to put it all on it on Ed Donatel because I do think that the Vikings defense really needs to do a better job of uh, uh, drafting talent as well as developing talent. Uh, because like Rick Spielman had some good picks. Don't get me wrong, but this last year, especially uh, with Lewis Seen and what happened there, I mean, a lot you can do there. But Andrew Booth Jr. Um, you know, there was uh, also I know guys like Brian Osmo that stepped up, but overall the Vikings they need to do a lot better in terms of uh, drafting, especially this next year. And uh, I think now that the Vikings have fired Ed Donatel, there's a couple things that they need to consider. And I think the very first move uh, that, that would make a lot of sense to me is hiring Brian Flores, the former Miami Dolphins coach and current uh, coach with the Pittsburgh Steelers. Now, background, yes, I uh, did spend some time with the Patriots there before getting a chance to coach the Dolphins. I think over 11 seasons, he had multiple different jobs there. But uh, three years of, as a head coach of the Dolphins, Went five and eleven his first year, ten and six his second, and then yes, did go nine and eight. I, I do think it's important to mention though, like literally that seven eight game winning streak. We pointed out how the Dolphins had literally the most underrated defense in the entire NFL that during that time. Like they were playing much better. They were allowing way fewer points doing a lot of different things. You guys go check that out. But obviously, Brian Flores knows how to coach defense. And you can see it here. Uh, you know, obviously did not start out great uh, there in Miami, but you can see them continually just all around getting better. So uh, defense, uh, they were, uh, what, 26th in your 30, excuse me, uh, 30th in yards. They went from, uh, you know, to 20, then to 15. They continually got better from 32nd in points to 6th, 16th. Yes, obviously it was uh, mainly due to that rough start during the 2021 season. Season, but overall, you can just see his defense is getting better, and I think it would make a lot of sense. Uh, I think Quasi Dolphamensa and Kevin O'Connell would be fools not to bring in Brian Flores. I think he's a guy that you can immediately put in. He's an instant, instant upgrade over a guy like Ed Donatel. Of course, you know, there's a lot of people that would just be an upgrade at this point. But honestly, Brian Flores makes a ton of sense. I think he brings experience. I think he brings a, a different kind of, um, you know, mind to this 3-4 defense that the Vikings will have. Uh, and I really think that he would be a really good hire for the Vikings. They need to hire Brian Flores or at least a guy that, uh, you know, is not Ed Donatel or related to Ed Donatel in any fashion. But overall, no, Ed Donatel, I give him nothing but love and respect. Obviously, the Vikings came out with a very nice sand with a uh, very nice release, excuse me. And, um, you know, you got to just give him nothing but love and support and wish him nothing but the best moving forward. But at the end of the day, I think the Vikings need to take a shot on Brian Flores, see what he can do to help out their defense uh, and see if they can help them uh, continue to establish that championship culture there uh, with the Minnesota Vikings. But let us know what you guys think. Make sure you guys like and subscribe down below. Leave a like and a comment. It helps people find the show. We greatly appreciate all the support that we've gotten and continue to get. You guys are all truly awesome. We love every single one of you. Down in the description below, you'll find all of our social Social media platforms so give us a like and a follow there also remember to give us a listen and sub on itunes and finally if you have anything else you'd like us to cover send us an email at the sports bp at yahoo.com or put it in the comment section down below and we would love to cover it but let us know what you guys think about the minnesota vikings needing to hire the future defensive coordinator of the minnesota vikings in brian flores